are you wondering which are the forms required when you enter the us as well as when you are about to enter the us so there are a lot of forms including i20 i9 1094 forms all of these forms will be discussed in this video so if you are interested keep watching so hello guys my name is rigel and if you're new to the channel my uh, like i'm studying at uci and i'm a data science major pursuing masters in data science here aur is video mein baat karne wale kaun kaun se aise forms hain jo aapko zarurat padegi janne ki jab aap us mein aane wale hain aur jab aap us mein enter kar chuke hain so bahut sare forms hote hain for example i9 hota hai i20 form hota hai 1024 form hota hai these all forms are like very confusing as well as very uh, like challenging to understand so is video mein hum unhi ko break down karenge aur samjhenge ki each and every form kya value hai aur kyu zaruri hai so the first form which uh, we will be talking about right now is i20 so i20 basically kya hai i20 basically proof hai ki aap eligible ho us mein study karne ke liye i20 is basically a form issued by your university for example i am studying at uci so when i get an admit from uci and when i show that hey i have enough funds uh, they'll be sending me an i20 and that i20 is basically a proof of my uh, like that i can go to uci and study as well as uh, that i20 period will be uh, for example my i20 will expire on 9th of december so till 9th of december i am an f1 student and my visa status is valid till that and after my i20 has been expired i have 3 months to look for a job aur us un 3 mahine mein job dhoondna hai aur uske baad aapka visa status student hi rehta hai but aapka i20 expire ho jata hai i20 is basically for the period when you are studying if you are coming for 2 years of masters your i20 will be for 2 years i came here for 15 months of masters program and it started on september 23 till december 9 next form before you enter the us is the i901 form so this form is basically a form for the service fee jab aap us visa ke liye jaate ho us visa ke liye apply karte ho to aapko service fee pay karni hoti hai that service fee ka jo form hai wo hota hai i901 form so when you pay the fees uh, you basically get a receipt which is i901 form you have to print it out and take it with you when you go to the us embassy for the visa now you are into the us the first form which you will be requiring right now is i94 form so i94 form basically aapke travel history record karta hai when you arrived into the us how many days you stayed into the us when you uh, like uh, departed from the us to go to like for example i went to india during my uh, winter break right now so i94 pe basically aapka har ek travel ka uh, date rehta hai how many days you have traveled how many days you have been in the us so all your travel history is known as an i94 form Uh, the next important form is the I 515A form. So, मतलब अगर आप US में आ जाते हो and you don't have the required documents to legally arrive into the US, so I 515A form uh, is basically issued to you for 30 days that you can legally stay in th- uh, like in the US for 30 days. अगर आपके पास documents नहीं हैं, उस 30 days के period के अंदर आपको ऐसे VP को documents भेजने होते हैं ताकि आपका जो uh, like visa status है वो maintain रहे. If you are unable to send the documents to ऐसे VP during this time, you will have to leave the us the next important form is the i539 form so agar aapko apna visa status change karna hai jaise ki f2 se f1 pe jana hai ya fir f1 se h1b pe change karna hai ya fir aapka visa status expire ho chuka hai ya fir aap m visa pe the aapka wo expire ho chuka hai aapko new new visa pe ek matlab change karna hai to that is the i539 a i539 form and that is basically used to change your immigration status from one uh, like f2 to f1 or like f1 to h1b The next form is आई I765 form. So as soon as you get a job, जो कैट है जॉब जैसे कि आपको जॉब मिल जाता है मास्टर्स के बाद दिस आई आई सेवन सिक्स फाइव फॉर्म इज बेसिकली अ फॉर्म फॉर एम्प्लॉयमेंट इन द यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स या फिर अगर आपको ऑफ कैम्पस एम्प्लॉयमेंट मिलती है जो आपको ऑफ आपको ऑफ कैम्पस मतलब वर्क करना अलाउ करते हैं यू हैव टू फिल आई आई सेवन सिक्स फाइव फॉर्म फॉर एम्प्लॉयमेंट इधर एट अ कंपनी और ऑफ कैम्पस नाउ फॉलोइंग अप फ्रॉम द प्रीवियस वीडियो आई सेवन सिक्स फाइव फॉर्म भरने के बाद आपको एक ऑथराइजेशन ई मेल आता है फ्रॉम द यू एस सी आई एस की आई सेवन सिक्स सिक्स फॉर्म आपको इशू किया जा चुका है और आप एम्प्लॉयमेंट के लिए एलिजिबल हो वैन यू गेट द आई सेवन सिक्स सिक्स फॉर्म यू कैन स्टार्ट वर्किंग एट योर डिजाइड कंपनी और योर ऑफ कैम्पस एम्प्लॉयमेंट यू हैव टू वेट फॉर द आई सेवन सिक्स सिक्स फॉर्म टू लाइक टू अराइव टू यू सो एज टू बिगेन योर लाइक ऑफिशियली वर्किंग फॉर द कंपनी यू वॉन्ट टू वर्क फॉर so this is it for the video guys and i hope uh, you get a good understanding of what exactly each and every form is in the us aur har ek form ka kya use hai aur kis kis timeline pe kya form use hota hai and uh, if you have any questions feel free to comment down below uh, ya fir linkedin or instagram pe aap connect kar sakte ho i'll be very happy to help you aur uh, yeah is video ke liye itna hi milte hain next video mein tab tak ke liye bye bye